Hi, Kev Tabletop Upgrades, and in this video, I want to show you one of my new products, which is the Netrunner compatible token set. So it comes in this case, although you can purchase it without the case, just tokens only, which I ship in a little cardboard sleeve. And inside the case, you've got everything you need for two players to play, or absolutely tons of tokens for a single player at a tournament. So in the top left here, we've got these credit tokens, which when flipped over are advanced for the court on one side. And they are two color, which is quite unusual and they're all pre-painted. So there's no peeling of masking tape or anything like that. Along the top here, we've got virus tokens, power tokens. It's got some brain damage or core damage as it's now known, tags and bad, pub bad publicity. So on the rear of these tokens here, you'll see there's a two so they can double up you can just flip it over just to double the quantity to reduce the number of tokens you need there. Now, we've also got click trackers, which are quite normal in um, Netrunner sets. They're obviously used to track your clicks in the game. And we've got three for the court and four for the runner matched in the deck colors. But one thing that makes this token set quite unusual, apart from the fact it comes in a lovely magnetic war chest compatible case, are these things, which are the modifier rings. Now, this allows you to get well over 100 value for any given token. So on one side of the 25, now 25 is a really high value for Netrunner. There'll be very few games where you need 25 plus 100 credits, um, but they're there should you need them. On the reverse side of this one, we've got a recurring credit symbol and we've got values of three, five, 10, and of course the 25. And the way these work is for most, most of the time you'll just be using single credits and you'll be flipping them over for single advanced tokens. But on occasion, you want to bulk them up and they just pop inside the modifier rings and now you've got a five credit. Or alternatively, it could be a, re a recurring credit. Like so. And you can move these around. Now, I'm sure they will get slightly loose over time, but it's a nice tight fit. You're not in danger of flexing or breaking it. And of course, they work with any given token. So if your runner has picked up extra tags, then and four isn't enough, then you can really go to town. And this poor Ken here is rocking nine tags at the moment. And that works with absolutely everything. So for most situations, you've got a single virus, flip it over for the two. But if you need more, here we have 10 virus tokens. So that is an overview of the token set. I'll leave you with some more shots of the token set in action, but uh, I hope you like the look of that. It's something that I've used a lot and absolutely love. You can find it on my website, tabletopupgrades.co.uk, and uh, let us know what you think in the comments. I'll see you in the next one.